11 employment pass and S pass holders working in the Infocom technology sector submitted false qualifications to the Manpower Ministry from 2018 to 2020. Their work passes were revoked and they are permanently barred from working in Singapore. Parliament has been told that MOM conducts extra checks by screening the qualifications submitted. We use a predictive fraud model um, and we stratify the academic institutions according to different levels of risk. For the highest risk, we require the employers to submit proof from a third party screening organisation as part of the work pass application process. These verification agencies have been pre-assessed by MOM and they are listed on our MOM website. If there is no verification proof that confirms that the diploma and the degree qualifications declared are genuine, the application will be rejected.